But we begin with breaking news. A reserve police officer from Highland Park has been shot and killed in Detroit. Yeah, and it happened while he was working at a security uh, nightclub called Opium at 8 Mile and Telegraph. Our Mike Wolfolk joins us live this morning from DPD headquarters. Mike, what are you learning? Well, here's what uh, we know happened through our sources. This happened around 1 o'clock this morning at a place called uh, Club Opium or Opium Lounge. It's on 8 Mile, just west of Telegraph Road. Very active scene when it all happened. But we got there about 4.30 this morning. Take a look at the video. Uh, there was an officer who came back to the scene. It had been cleared by this time, and it appeared that a detective was walking along the median on 8 Mile, possibly looking for some additional uh, evidence in this case. He walked down about a quarter of a mile with squad car following and then uh, they got back in the car and then left the scene. But what we're told happened through sources is that this Highland Park Reserve officer was off duty working as a security guard and he had to throw a couple of guys out of the club. Now we're told that those two guys waited in the parking lot and when the officer came out to check the parking lot they fired shots at him. Two maybe three shots. And uh, we're told that a third person who saw it happen actually fired shots back at the uh, first two guys. Now, we're told that police have all three uh, people in custody uh, this morning. Now, the officer, we are told, was taken to Botsford Hospital, hospital, I should say, by squad car. They did not wait for an ambulance, and he died in surgery. We have not been uh, given his name as of yet, and uh, Chief uh, Kevin Coney out of Highland Park has not made any statements about this case as of yet as well. As we continue to gather information, we of course will pass it along to you, but for now we can tell you that this Highland Park Reserve officer dead this morning after being shot at Club Opium. We're live in downtown Detroit at police headquarters. Mike Wolfolk, 7 Action News.